It's Thursday, so let's eat. How do you like your chips and cheese? It's worth a trip to a Mexican restaurant in Welford to find out. 7 News' is Christine Scarpelli is live at Chips and Cheese. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Fred. Can you see the cheese oozing on this burrito? It's the burrito, the big burrito, I should say. Chips and Cheese is a great restaurant in Welford. You don't want to miss this place right next to an Exxon gas station, but you'll hear more about it. Take a listen. Yum, chips and cheese. Let's be honest, some days that's the whole reason I go to a Mexican restaurant. But word on the street is this place has a whole lot more to offer. As always, you be the judge here at Chips and Cheese Restaurant near Welford. Most people have this stigma of, oh, they are to the gas station. They are not good at all. But here it's different. At least try for one time and you will find out how worth it is to be here. I see nothing wrong with filling up your gas tank and your stomach in one stop. Owner Alejandro Nieto says he's always dreamed of owning his own restaurant and cooking nachos like this, even back to his childhood in Mexico. He says he moved to the U.S. at 21 and spent every moment he could working in Mexican restaurants. I knew how to serve her, how to take care of the people, and now I learned to cook. Boy Diddy, alongside partner Alejandra Lesojo from Colombia, the two want to give you a delicious and authentic experience. We just make our food with love, and that's their main ingredient. Love and cheese. Extra cheese, please. <laughs> That's why they say. It's all over their bestseller, the Burrito California. Steak, beans, rice. Now we're gonna put some lettuce, some sour cream, guacamole, and some pico de gallo. Crunchy tortilla, I like it that way. I like spicy, but not too much. I'm no Mexican. <laughs> Here's a secret, their specialty homemade pink sauce. It's a little garlic, chipotle sauce, and more. They just put it on top. And then take a bite? Yes. Will you, you take, take a, a bite, bite with me? Yes. All right, chips and cheese. Chips and cheese. Mmm. Mm. That's amazing. Another favorite, tacos meats. Corn tortillas with Mexican sausage and a kick. Garlic, pepper, chili powder, just mix it together. So spicy, orange salsa, and green salsa. This last dish, super authentic, enchiladas mexicanos. Alejandra says it's so popular with customers from Mexico, they use slow roasted pork. We put garlic, onions, we add orange juice to give a better flavor. Add very spicy green sauce, lettuce, sour cream, tomato, and enjoy. As you can see, Chips and Cheese is far more than just a restaurant next to a gas station. Huge portions and friendly faces like Maria here from Chips and Cheese in Welford, we say, let's, let's eat. eat. Aww, very good. Yum. All right, what did you guys think? Does that not look outstanding? It tastes so good and you saw proof. I was eating it there on the screen. This is Alejandro and Alejandra. They run Chips and Cheese, open plenty of hours at 11 starting this morning until 8, Monday through Saturday. See? Yes, Alejandro, there are lots of viewers that might want to come to your restaurant. How do you like to make the viewers feel? I like to make feel welcome to this place and offer them great food here and um, I'm pretty sure they're gonna like it because we make all the food with a lot of love and it looks very different to the rest of the restaurants. I agree. It's beautiful. Guys, look at the color and there's cheese all over. Everything. Isn't that the best part? Very good. Yes. These two are some of the nicest people I've ever come to meet at one of these restaurants. you got to check them out. Chips and Cheese is in Welford, open Monday through Saturday, 11 to 8. Yes. You correct me if I get that wrong. That's okay. Correct. All right. What do you guys think?